I'm Terrell Ogle, and this is Terrell News for April, running a few days late, but it's the way it goes. Tarot of a Moon Garden Borderless Deck and Book Set. I did hear from a couple of people that Tarot of the Moon Garden was really kind of cool, but it was either the cardstock or something else they didn't like about it. But the fact that this is borderless, and my, that is a thin card, if that's actually the dimensions. But yeah, that's looking good. Pre-order, available June, $31. Seems a bit, seem, well, it comes with a book too, but okay. So I'm definitely picking this up. This is uh, highly recommended for many people, and I'm glad that we're coming out with a borderless version of this. The Luminous Humanness. I don't know. That's a lot of S. The Lu Luminous Humanness cards. Looks pretty cool. I mean, I wouldn't throw it out of bed here. We got the Oracle cards by Kelly Sullivan Walden. And uh, yeah, that looks really nice. I like kind of the the... I like the effects, and I like the graphics that I'm kind of seeing. We have dancing. Uh, we have all sorts of cool things. So that's coming out at 28 bucks. That is uh, coming out soon, this month, assuming lace. So that's looking pretty good. Practical Magic appears that is already out. 37 bucks is a bit steep. Ugh, that is a bit steep indeed. You get, wait, 36 cards for $37 is a bit, that is a bit much. I'm not saying it looks bad. It looks good. I like it. We got Serene Connelly, Connelly, okay, uh, Selena Finich, and uh, over here for an Oracle, if you like 36 cards for $37 plus tax, uh, but yeah, that is on Llewellyn. I guess you could wait till the sale and hope for the best, but Tarot the Witch's Garden is coming out. Sasha Graham, I like it, coming out in May. You don't have much longer to wait for this. And my, it looks good. It looks really good. So this is definitely one that I'm picking up. Already pre-ordered it. I will be uh, showing that off when I get it. We also have Terry of the Fairy Folk. This one is coming out in July. A little bit of a wait for this, but it does look supreme. That looks so good. I love the graphics and the art. And sort of the, the just this mystical weirdness about it. It just sort of captures you and brings you in. It's almost like a little bit of a watercolor kind of thing. It is a Rider Waite Smith style deck. 78 Fantastical Scenes coming out again in July. This is a boxed deck. So 24 bucks, pretty reasonable. I did pick it up on the sale. Living Tarot is by Susan Chang. She made some good books, a lot of good stuff here. If you want one author that I just pick up every book they make, Susan Chang is it. So yeah, this is a card of the day draw to masterful and usefulness. Discover how tarot reflects life and life reflects tarot. This is coming out in May and this is a guaranteed purchase for me. While we're on Llewellyn, Herbs and Plants, Lenormand Oracle Cards. That looks really nice. I, when it comes to Lenormand, I think all of us kind of like a nice, simple, straightforward images, just straight to the point. And I think this does a very good job in uh, getting that done. So you have a lot of very cool cards, very pretty uh, graphics on here. And this looks like a win-win. For 20 bucks especially, that is on my list. Wanders Tarot, already pre-ordered this. This is one that is hyped for good reason. You're coming up with um, uh, Peruca Zizi. Just makes some great, outstanding graphics. Look at this. Artwork is just fantastic. Wander's Tarot is a must-have for me, especially after the other uh, cards that they have made. ZZ has also made the, uh, where's it at? Tarot of Oppositions. A lot of y'all just love it. Dream Interpretation cards. A lot of y'all just love that. So, they're back. Also is the Inspirational Wicca Oracle cards. Now, this is one, 30 bucks, but I love the graphics. I mean, this is something where I've kind of pooed on the graphics before in this style, but there's something about this that just captures my imagination. I think it looks very good. Uh, got a lot of very cool looking things going on here, and I just like the overall look and feel of this. So this is definitely one that I pre-ordered as well. We also have the Tarot of the Longest Dream. I've been talking about this forever. The graphics on this is spectacular. You have to have this in your pre-order immediately. Looking at borderless. 
Uh, he just looks great. This is one of those that just really captures my attention immediately. I've been hyping it for a long time. So this is one I have to have, and it is around the corner in November. I know that seems like a long time, but getting your pre-order in early is always a big, big benefit, right? Because you can lock down the price, especially when you have Llewellyn's uh, big sale, 35% off of the whole store. Tear of the Enchanted Garden is another one that looks really pretty. It looks kind of like the Paulina deck. This is from Rosanna Paula, so, but, but it just looks like one of the Paulina decks. Um, looks so pretty and imaginative. Kind of reminds me a little bit of the, um, uh, the Dark Moon uh, yeah, tarot, but yeah, uh, looking pretty good. Let's hop over to Amazon and see what we got going on here. Sacred She Tarot Deck and Guidebook. Now, 30 bucks, and it has a lot of images now, and all of the images look great. This looks cool. This just looks cool. So, you know, this is going to be one of the ones I think it's going to be collectible, in just my opinion. But, yeah, it looks like one of these ones that's going to be kind of collectible. Yeah, perfection, self-expression, roots. So it is a different system, obviously. You do have a guidebook, which is pretty handy. So the creator of the Osho Zen and the Tao Oracle, the Tao Oracle, sorry. Uh, but, yeah looks fantastic now it is it is one that may not be for everybody i can see that but it's going to be one for me uh 30 bucks i already pre-ordered it waiting for it to happen midnight magic a tarot of mushrooms number one in mushrooms and biological sciences you know i've you know we support all of the mushrooms that's a lot of graphic or a lot of uh, previews so i appreciate that we got uh chicken of the woods as the fool we got all of the shrooms. So if you like shrooms and everybody likes a good shroom, then pick this up. It is on sale for 21 bucks. That's a good deal. That's a pretty good deal. 144 pages. I don't mean if that's the book or what, but uh, it's definitely one that I have already pre-ordered. Unfolding Path is another one that looks so good. Let's look at the images. That is very pretty. That is very, very pretty. I love this. I love sort of the that light sears kind of feel to it, whatnot. But yeah, I love the, like no border, but it has kind of that, you know, mixed watercolor effect with that. So that looks so good. It looks so good. It is vivid artwork indeed. And that is one that uh, definitely is on my list. What else is, have they done Crystal Ball, Oracle, Unfolding Path, which is familiar. So, okay, so I have no idea. Dark Crystal, I'd be excited, but Inside Editions and Gilly, you know. Dark Crystal, you know, Inside Editions and Gilly. Ah, oh, man. I mean, I don't know. I'm getting tired of these. I'm getting just tired of these, man. That's just something I'm just getting tired of them, but, you know, if this is something you're loving it, you're like, I love the Lord of the Rings tarot. I love all of the Gilly stuff. I love all of the inside editions. Well, God bless you, you know. Tarot for pregnancy. It is an inclusive deck for radical, magical birthing folks. Well, I don't know what a, uh, okay. Well, you know, I don't want to get involved in all that, I guess. But if you're birthing folk, <laughs> what the fuck am I looking at? <laughs> okay, if you're birthing folk, you may want this. If you're if you're a birthing folk, you may want this. So yeah, if if you're a birthing folk, then this might be something that you want to birth, or you want to give birth to, you know, or you want to give them money so they can give birth, or I don't know what's going on. Let's see what else is uh, what else am I gonna see here? Um, all right, um, yeah, uh, okay, all right. So what what the hell? um okay uh all right so yeah here we go all right so if you're birthing folk 22 bucks get your money on the table rosebud tarot here we go uh yeah rosebud tarot it's a little out there that's a little out there but uh okay but if you if you want it that if if you want it what if you want it, then okay. Uh, what? Okay, okay. 
sure, if you want that, then, I mean, pick it up. Pick it up. It's all you. It's all you if you want the Rosebud Tarot. Um, your daddy's That's. I don't think this is my daddy. Let me look. Um, Rev Dale Bruning Jr. I don't think that's, unless some unfortunate accident has occurred, I don't think that's my daddy. I I don't know. I mean, I don't have any genetic in proof, but modern manga tarot. This is a manga tarot for you. It is modern and it is manga. And let's see what kind of graphics we have. We have the hanged man. We have justice. And it looks like that's all we got. And we got one more. We got that. Uh, I guess that's high priest. It's okay. Uh, I mean, it looks okay. Interesting. 26 bucks. Pick it up. You also have the Marvel Tarot and Guidebook. Yeah, I hope, you know, there's a lot of material for this. I hope they did it good. Hope they do it good from Universe Publisher. 208 pages, 25 bucks, seems okay. It is your favorite Marvel characters, Loki to Galactus. The fact that they included Galactus, that the fact that they included Galactus and Moon Knight gives me a lot of encouragement. This this gives me a lot of encouragement. I'm just telling you right now. Galactus and Moon Knight, that, that gives me good, good feelings. The mega-sized tarot, Hocus Pocus Dick. Siegel is not cranking out enough tarots. We have to re-release the existing ones in mega-sized deck. And I don't know how big the mega size deck is. I mean, if you say your deck is mega sized, then you should po put some dimensions in here. And I don't see dimensions. Maybe there's some dimension. No, I don't see dimensions. I don't know what mega size means. I don't know what larger format. You know, some dimensions would be great. Pick it up if you were a mega size kind of person. The wiser tarot sticker book now i'm showing you this because you got 2500 stickers 32 complete sets 2500 stickers i repeat 32 complete sets for 16 dollars will i drop in a hundred dollars to pick up a bunch of these absolutely so if you want yours, you should go ahead and buy it because I'm going to buy what you don't. <laughs> That's, that is nice. That is nice. That is a beautiful giveaway on the stream, and I am going to dump half a paycheck on that. All right, Magicians, Martyrs, and Madmen. Travis McHenry, they actually got his name right. Half the time they butcher it. Travis is back. With this deck that was exclusive on Kickstarter. Hey, you can get it, you know, right from Brockpool Publishing now. And uh, we'll see if Travis will send us a copy of this. This looks really good. All right. Uh, Yuletide. Talked about it before. Christmas decks are hard to find. Uh, this is beautiful, beautiful, and beautiful. And yes, I am going to pick this up. And I am going to love this. It, you know, winter time tarot are hard to find. There's your one. Bob Ross Oracle. If you like the happy trees, we have happy trees right now. We got the paint. We got, you know, it looks a little uninspired. The graphics there, they look a little uninspired for especially that. Like at least include some Bob Ross type in graphics. But eh. Beloved Dead. If you love Dead, Carrie Paris is here to satiate you from Wiser Books Publishing. Um, we have The Beloved Dead. We have Shine. We have many different people here. And Oracle for Divining Ancestral Wisdom from Carrie Paris. Why does that name sound familiar? Uh, oh, The Relative Tarot, Siren Song, Behind the Fortune. Okay, Horse Breeds. There we go. So, yeah. Uh, pick that up. Terrell for the Great Outdoors. Another one that I'm excited about just based upon this one image. If the rest of the cards look like this, I will take it. I want to see this desperately. Let me refresh. And we have... No, we don't have more image. This this one could be deck of the year. 
I'm, I'm not going to lie right now. This one could be deck of the year if they do this right. And from that graphic, it looks like they did it right. Uh, we also have Tarot of the Vampires. This is one that Teddy is waiting for. 31 bucks. I already got my pre-order in. Locked down that price. It's borderless. It's pretty. It's beautiful. It's got a lot of cool stuff. We need these kind of decks. Illustrated by Craig Meyer. And uh, this is looking fantastic. Guaranteed on the pre-order list. The Crowley Tarot. We got a one Crowley Tarot mass market. We got one on Kickstarter. I'm getting both. It looks good. I'm not saying it looks as amazing as all the others, but hey, this looks pretty handy. I like it. I think it's really cool. I love that we're getting into this, you know. I love that other people are making their own versions of this. I love it. I love it. The Grimalkin's Curious Cats Tarot, 80 cards. I'm not sure if that's a Grimalkin. It looks similar, maybe similar, maybe not be. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say it's the exact same or not, because I don't remember. But uh, yeah, MJ, anything MJ produces, I buy because I support MJ. They've had some fantastic price. Like um, their first Kickstarter was a Grimalkin Tarot, but it was um, in a tin. I mean, how many Kickstarters do you get in a tin? Like none. And it was 35 bucks in a tin, full sized. And ever since then, I was like, all right, I'm supporting this person. This is fantastic. So we have an Oracle of Destiny. Looking very cool. Celestial Edition. Oracle of Destiny. I'm not sure how many cards there is, but uh, that's, a, that's a cheap price. 99. Is there, wait, is there 99 cards? Or is this, oh, it's a na magical book of guidance. Okay. So it's a magical book of guidance. So it's an Oracle, meaning not actually an Oracle. Shiva Moon is uh looking pretty rough here but please uh, support the shiva moon they're very nice to come on the stream they did a great job and beautiful cards everybody loves it when i use the thing so if you want to pick this up you got a couple more days to go taro frogs cute like it 155 backers that is a oh, and 194 backers that's a lot of backers and a lot of money so hey there you go the uh, Earth Tarot by Taylor Brin. Taylor Brin was kind enough to give us some of her previous decks. So I support Taylor Brin with all Taylor Brin does. That looks freaking amazing. And the level of detail in Taylor Brin's stuff is outstanding. You need to back that. Oracle of, I'm not even going to pronounce that, Chinese Tarot Relaunch. It's super, super cute. Super cute. It looks really good. That looks really good. How much is this? How much is this? I, you know, full version book, no. Super Early Bird. Super Early Bird still available? Uh, 21 bucks. Wait, is that for a tarot? Or is that for an oracle? It is an oracle. Uh, 100 fortune, 100 fortune telling. Is that 100, 100 cards? Wait, is that 100 cards for 20 bucks? Is that legit? I don't know. I'm going to come back and look at this again, but that looks really good. That looks really, really good. Those graphics are cool. Those graphics are really cool. I really like this. Okay, but anyway, uh, you have the Violet Soul already back this. That is so pretty. That is so good. Uh, but yeah, Violet Soul is from Ukrainian Artist. And uh, yeah, looking very nice. Looking very nice. Can't wait to get this one. We got the Thoth. We already supported this. This is the Thoth Tarot. Got to support it. Um, Cappy Bay or Cappy B. Cappy Bay Room? I don't know. Whatever. Anyway, it looks cute. It is. Looks like hippos. It looks like hippos. And it's kind of cute. And, you know, look at how cute this is. I mean, look how cute this is. First created, but that is so cute. They did a damn good job. For That's the first time they've touched a tarot deck. you got to be kidding me. That's the first time they've touched a tarot deck. Are you serious? That is pure pro. That is pure pro. So I did uh, support this one. This is fantastic. I can't wait to get it. We also have the Animal Botanica Tarot, and that looks really good. That looks really good. And i got to have this one, too. Okay, we just did the Thoth. Why am I clicking on it again? Now, Magic Cottage, it's already over. I did buy two of these. I bought their original and I bought their new one. And the graphics are amazing. I can't wait to get it. 
I'm Don over here for this one. Uh, Artisan Tarot is coming out with some new stuff. They got bridge size Trump. They got leather wallets for your uh, bridge size Trump cards. They got drawstring bra bags. They got zippered pouches. They got everything. We got corduroy zippered. But like this Artisan Tarot is just just cutting edge. Artisan Tarot is cutting edge in everything they do. They are on the cutting edge of everything that they're doing. And the fact that they have all these reading claws, pouches, all this stuff is just pure magic. Go support them. Feldman Sisters Tarot. I got an email about this. This is from the guy who's uh, bringing out some really good tarot decks. So kind of interested in what this looks like. I want to see more, um, you know, more from this. But yeah, that's it. And that is it for me. A Patreon? That's right. You get a lot of stuff for it. Not a lot of money. Okay. For five bucks, you get 20 hours of Create Your Tarot course. I teach you detailed how to draw animals. Detailed how to draw digitally. I walk you through the application. I walk you through how to make it. I walk you through oil painting examples. I got uh, pastel examples. I got colored pencil. I got everything. How to draw your own tarot cards because it's a good income source. I'll be honest with you. That's a really good income source. And if you can draw realistic animals, you can draw your neighbor's dog, what have you. They'll pay you 60, 70, 100 bucks for that behind the readings every week. If you're wondering why I said what I said, I tell you 10% uh, why I said what I said in my streams. I tell you exactly why, what we're looking at. I go through details. 10% off everything in my store. Hey, that's worth the five bucks alone. I mean, if you're going to buy something, right? You get your name in my tarot decks, books. You get the name in the video credits. You also get a free Lenormand digital deck and a cloth. So you can go print it out. And that is on screen now for you to look at. As well as, if you want to dump 10 bucks in, you get everything over here, plus a weekly live stream. You get an hour with me once a week in a live stream. You want to ask me a question? Hey, why did you say that? I want to help on this. I want to help on this. I'm here for you. Live stream every week. Ask me anything you want. They're all uh, archived off too, so you can watch previous ones. I teach you details, deep Deep details about tarot cards, how to read, what to do, etc. If you want me to do anything, I'll do what. If you want to see a magic trick, <laughs> whatever you want to see, I mean, I'm live streaming. I mean, between me and you. So ask me anything. This is private to Patreon. You also get all my digital books and audio books for 10 bucks. You get all the digital books and audio books. That's a steal. That is an easy, uh, easy way to go there. Now, if you want to go 20 bucks a month, you get a monthly, a 20-minute private reading with me. That's a dollar a minute. That's extremely, extremely reasonable. All of this is available to you right now. Go to my Patreon link in the description and become a supporter. It helps me uh, make more videos. It helps me just make content that you want to see. It helps me a lot. So please, if you want to support me, I will reimburse you with a lot of stuff. I mean, it's not like you're just throwing money at me and hoping for the best. You're, you're getting things back. So I greatly appreciate your support. And thank you for watching this video. I will see you next time.